Hey guys, welcome to another vlog. So today, pag usapan natin is converting your credit card points to air miles and all of those basics that you need to know. I've been receiving a lot of comments also on TikTok and um, you know, parang ano ba yung pwedeng gawin? Paano ba natin gagawin yung pagko-convert ng mga points? In this video, I'm going to walk you through ano yung mga kailangan mo alam and we're just going to walk through about some of those mga credit cards that I've tried back then na na-convert ko siya into points or into air miles, from points to air miles, and then tingnan natin kung ano yung mga proseso na kailangan mo alam, and we'll walk you through it. Okay guys, first things first, ito yung makita ng basics mo. Number one, kailangan mo isipin, okay, sa ano ba yung gusto mong sakyan na airplane? Ano gusto mong sakyan na airlines? Kasi number one, do you have that membership from that airlines? Yes or no? Kasi, for example, kung wala ka naman, let's say, membership sa Mabuhay Miles, which is Philippine Airlines, paano i-convert ng banko yan to Air Miles? There's no way. So, you have to register first. For example, gusto mo sumaki ng Singapore Airlines, then you have to have Chris Flyer, which is the partner or which is like the rewards program ni Singapore Airlines. The same with Air Asia, it's called their Big Points, di ba? Or A Big Points. And it's the same with Cebu Pacific, that is called Get Go, now it's called Get uh, Go Rewards. So, yun yung una mong uunahin mo. You always have to remember saan ka may membership. Kung wala, you have to create that membership. Kasi yung banko, for you to convert those points into air miles, kailangan meron kang membership doon sa airlines yun. Kung wala, there's no way for them to convert it to air miles. Kasi saan nila ilalagay yan? Saan nila iaangkla yan? Hindi mo pwede sabihin, ang um, pangalan ko is Jax Reyes, doon mo siya iaangkla. Huh? Eh, it's always to a membership number. Kung wala ka membership number, hindi pwede. So that's first. Second, whenever you're choosing a credit card for a preferred airlines mo, you also have to choose kung yung banko na yun, meron bang partnership with that airlines. For example, BPI actually only has three partnership. BPI can only convert your points to air miles sa Air Asia, Chris Flyer, and Mabuhay Miles. So guys, remember that ha? Wala siya for example sa Cathay Pacific. Kung gusto ko mag Cathay Pacific na Asia Miles yung partner nila or yung program nila, hindi kaya ni a BPI yon. Another, another example here is also with RCBC. Si RCBC can only be Mabuhay Miles, which is Philippine Airlines, Get Go, which is, I think, hindi na updated to kasi wala naman ng Get Go, but that's Cebu Pacific, Asia Miles, which is Cathay Pacific, and A Rewards, which is Air Asia. So guys, ito yung mga kailangan natin pag-isipan. Number one, whenever you get a credit card or whenever you go to a bank and you, wanted, you want to claim or you want to get miles, you also have to check anong mga banko yon. A lot of our local Philippine banks are limited when it comes to partners. And to be honest, the best and the biggest and breadth of partners will be Citibank. Citibank kasi ang dami niyang partners. They have around 60 airline partners. I can't go through it one by one. But we can see and I've seen na marami talaga siyang partners. Tulad na, they have Asia Miles, they have British Airways, they have Emirates and Etihad as well. Not only that, they also have Eva Air and they have Air France and KLM. So guys, ito yung mga sum of what Citibank has. They also have Qantas and they also have Qatar Airways. So guys, ito yung mga samples na sinasabi ko. If you want to choose a credit card, you have to go with a credit card also. Kung saan yung preferred airlines mo or saan mo gusto pumunta or saan yung gusto mo mag-i-convert yung points mo to air miles, yun siya. Because again, di ba, you want to claim or you want to earn points to travel. But the question there is, number one, meron ba... Meron ka ba membership doon? Eh kung wala, an kwenta noon, di ba? Claim ka nga ng claim. Ano ka ng ano, parang uh, 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 earn ka ng earn ng points, eh hindi mo pala ma-convert, di ba? So yun yung uunahin natin. So those are the basics that you need to know. Okay guys, now let's just say that you already have the membership, let's say to any of those airline partners, and then you have the points in itself as well. So guys, remember, Whenever we're redeeming points rin, paminsan, or most often than not, there will be a minimum points requirement that you need to convert to airline miles to be eligible. So, hindi siya pwede parang, ah, makakonvert ako ng 10 airline, airline points or air miles points. Pwede ko na ba siya ipakonvert? No. Sometimes may minimum siya na 1,000, 1,500 for you to be able to be eligible to convert first. 
And then, may incremental siya of, let's say, 500 points, 1,000 points, 2,000 points for you to convert. So, hindi siya pwede parang, konting-konti na yung points mo, pwede mo na siya i-convert, hindi po siya ganon. Paminsan, may minimum points siya. So, it depends bank per bank. Okay? So, that's one thing. So, what I wanna go right now through it is yung kay BPI. I think yun yung importante. Pasadahan muna natin yung kay BPI para at least alam natin. I'll give you a step-by-step -step process how we're gonna do it. Pag-usapan lang natin siya. And guys, it's not hard. Let's not think na mahirap siya. It's very easy actually. And to be honest, if you have enough points, actually it can really be it can really be rewarding. But again, guys, munting paalala ko sa inyo. Do not spend for the mere fact of earning air miles. Spend because you need it. This is just one way for you to travel, but this is not the only way for you to travel. Paminsan, mas matipid pa bumili ng sale na airline ticket. Air miles is just for you to augment sometimes. You can use air miles to book, let's say, a one-way ticket kung kailangan mo, or you can use air miles to upgrade your ticket as well. I personally do not recommend na I want to travel and I claim ko siya sa air miles. The best way to use credit card air miles is to augment yung kulang mong points whenever you keep traveling. So, pang pangdagdag siya. No, or number two is kung merong mga promos na i-convert mo yung credit card points mo, i-doble siya ng airline partners. Yun yung best way for you to use your credit card points to air miles. Other than that, if it's really just claiming your air miles through spending, kung wala mga promo, I personally would tell you to avoid. Get something else with your points. Sala. Okay, let's begin. Okay, so guys, I will look from time to time dun sa right side ko kasi nandito yung kodigo ko. So for example, BPI. Let's give an example sa BPI. Si BPI, you can convert it to mabuhay miles. So for you to be able to get 1,000 mabuhay miles, you need 8,000 real thrills rewards regular points. And then if it's Air Asia na 1,000 Air Asia rewards points, you would need 4,000 real thrills rewards regular points. And of course, uh, Singapore Airlines, a Chris Flyer, for 1,000 Chris Flyer miles, you need 5,000 Real Thrills Rewards regular points. So, ang usually, paano ba natin siya i-claim? So, for BPI, it's very simple. Ito ang importante, di ba? You can request via the phone or email. So, depending on how you want to do it, for BPI, ganito siya. So, how I usually do it, I actually call the hotline na lang kasi mas gusto ko mas preferred ko sa hotline. Um, but by all means, if you want via Email, you can do it. So, ito yung mga things na kailangan meron ka. Number one, you need the card or customer number. This goes with Air Asia, Mabuhay Miles. This goes with Chris Flyer. And you need the item code. The item code, you can find it on the website of BPI. So, example non, if you just look into kanina kong pinos yun, ba? For Air Asia or for Chris Flyer, it's 112010. Yun yung code niya. And then, item quantity, ilan yung gusto mo i-claim. And then, you also need the Chris Flyer Miles membership card. So, membership card ng Air Asia rin, at saka ni Mabuhay Miles. And you need the card ni card holder name as registered doon sa partner na yon. Sa card Chris Flyer ba yan, Philippine Airlines ba yan, or Air Asia. You need the last name and first name. So, guys, that's why I prefer to call it via the hotline. Kasi you, whenever they ask the questions, kaya mo ibigay. So, all of the things that you need to give should match whatever you have. Kung ano yung pangalan mo sa card na yan, kung anong pangalan mo doon sa membership card na yan, it has to match. Kasi pag hindi nagmamatch yung kahit isang number lang yan, guys, they will not be able to convert your points. Madidelay yan. And usually, to process these points, it takes 2 weeks or around 15 working days. So guys, medyo matagal siya. So, yun yung kailangan mo isipin. Hindi siya parang pagka tinawag ko na siya, the following day it's there. No. So you have to be careful with that. Okay, another thing naman that I wanna share here is also yung kay RCBC. So mga RCBC friends natin dyan, RCBC naman is ganito siya. Reward points mo, i-convert mo muna siya to what they call RCBC Bank Card Air Miles. So guys, ganito lang siya. So RCBC parang pinahirapan nila. Yung reward points mo, gagawin mo daw muna siya to RCBC Bank Card Air Miles. Tapos yung Air Miles niyan, gagawin mo siya to one Air Miles. So basically, um, you need to have one is to one. So each point mo is equivalent to one RCBC Bank Card Air Miles. But you need five RCBC Card Air Miles to be equivalent to one mile. But yung one mile na yon can be turned into one Air Miles sa Mabuhay Miles or Get Go or Asia Miles and A Rewards. So guys, ito lang siya. 
If we're going to remember it, ang basically where you can ride here is only Mabuhay Miles, Philippine Airlines yan, Cebu Pacific, Asia Miles. Ang maganda sa Asia Miles, marami siyang partner, but predominantly, pinakasulit na points yan will be in Cathay Pacific. And then Air Asia for Air Rewards. So limited pa rin siya. So for example, if you look at this, kahit na ganun yung sinasabi ni RCBC, RCBC has a minimum of redemption na 2,500 RCBC bank card air miles muna for you to be able to convert. Yun yung pinaka-minimum niya. So parang yung 2,500 RCBC bank card air miles is equivalent to 500 miles of that respective airlines that you choose or that airline partner. Yun yung minimum niya bago mo pwede or bago ka makaka-convert. It's the same process for RCBC. It's the same. You call the hotline, you convert the same information that you need to give them pare pares lang siya across the board so you always have to make sure that again i keep telling you guys you have to be member of that airline partners kasi kung hindi wala ka. hindi mo ma-convert yun di ba so guys in include ko si city bank here kasi city bank ang gusto ko dito is breadth of partners ito yung gusto ko ipakita sa inyo na if it's more for like an international credit card mas marami siyang partners so for city bank it's one it's eight points Basically, 8 points nila is equivalent to 1 Air Miles nila. Siyempre, iba siya kay Premier Miles. Si Premier Miles is iba eh. 1.6 Premier Miles points siya equivalent to 1 Miles. So, medyo iba siya. Pero for other cards ng Citibank, ganito siya. So, you have Chris Flyer. You have Thai Airways. You also have Turkish Airways. You have Virgin Atlantic. You have Qantas. You have Qatar Airways. You have Eva Air. You have KLM. You have Air France. You have Emirates. Etihad, you have Asia Miles as well and British Airways. But what is very different lang with Citibank right now na napansin ko is naka on hold ngayon ng points conversion niya to Palma Buhay Miles and Cebu Get Go. So hindi siya pwede or hindi ka makaka-claim ng ganung mga points. But what they are offering is gawin mo lang daw cash yung or rebate yung points mo para technically para na offset na yung ticket na binili mo. Yun yung ino-offer nila. But again guys, ito yung sabi ko. When you have an international credit card, definitely you have more partners, and you need to choose ko ano partner yung gusto mo sa kyan. For example, in the same way, when you're gonna convert it to Citibank, si Citibank madale jon is pwede kang online through their Citibank Thank You Rewards portal. But also, ang ginagawa ko again, gal gusto ko nga na via hotline. I just call the hotline. It's so much easier to convert there. And sa sabi ko lang yung number ko or yung para membership number ko, and they will be able to convert those points. So where do I personally usually do it? So parang now it's more of my story time. Ako personally guys, I would only always convert it number one back then with Cebu Get Go because nagkakaroon ng sales si Cebu Get Go noon. And then Philippine Airlines because of the fact na sa Philippine Airlines, lagi ko rin sinasakyan. And last but not the least is definitely Cathay Pacific Air Asia. These are the only three airlines that I would convert my points to because these are the three airlines that I usually ride. So yun din lagi ko sinasabi sa inyo. Go with the airlines where you are always riding. Go with the airlines kung sino talaga yung favorite mo. For example, I have a friend who always goes to Singapore kasi yung brother niya nasa Singapore. So for example, sa kanya, why is yung Chris Flyer? Doon niya kinoconvert lahat ng mga points niya. Do not also forget that, guys, itong mga points na to, definitely some of those bigger airlines will have airline partners. For example, Chris Flyer or si Singapore Airlines is part of the Star Alliance network. So Star Alliance network guys, marami mga kind of different airline partners yan. Air Asia is part of the One World Alliance. For example, si Cathay Pacific partner niya si Qatar Airways. So like ako, I would always ride saan man yung mas preferred ko or kung saan may membership na ako. Kasi I can parang earn points. Let's say if I ride a Qatar Airways na airlines, I can convert those points into my Cathay Pacific Air Asia or Asia Miles na Um, membership card and I can earn club points there. Club points yung parang for you to rise the level and parang kahit naka economy class ka lang you can enter the lounge of Cafe Pacific. So, ito yung lagi ko sinasabi sa inyo. Whenever we're traveling, make sure na wais tayo here. Um, to be honest, yung mga airlines natin here in the Philippines, katulad ng Philippine Airlines, basura yung network niya kasi they, they're not part of the bigger network across the globe. Si Cebu Pacific, Air Asia, medyo walang mga network rin yan. So, parang useless lang siya. So, my preference definitely is go with the airlines kung saan ka nagsasakay. Earn points kung saan, let's say, if it's part of the bigger 
alliances across the world. Doon mo pwede i-convert yung mga points. And then, doon ka usually sumasakay ng airlines mo to earn more reward points from them. Yung credit card points mo, isaksak mo doon for the mere fact na gusto mo lang to augment your points because sometimes when you're booking airline and air miles na through points, paminsan nagkakakulang ka eh sa mga na-earn mo usually when you just travel. But if you use your credit card points to augment it para mag-increase, then you might be able to redeem a whole ticket na, a round trip ticket. Next is, pwede mo rin kasi gamitin yung air miles mo to convert into or to upgrade your ticket. So paminsan ko economy ka lang siya, na-upgrade mo siya into let's say a business class ticket through points. So yun yung sinasabi ko na medyo sulit na yan. Kasi at least guys, parang for you, you don't feel na gumastos ka ng pera because nga, through points mo siya nakuha, di ba? But let's just say, but in reality, lahat naman yun may peso value, may katumbas pa rin siya. Technically, nagbayad ka lang. It just makes you feel better dahil parang hindi mo siya binayaran. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. So at least na-share ko sa inyo how to earn your points or how to earn your air miles, how to convert your air miles. So it's always following the bank's rule, but it's very easy. And then last but not the least, ang lagi ko sinasabi sa inyo, use your credit card wisely, use your points and earn your points wisely as well. Huwag po tayo gumagastos for the sake of you want to travel because that will never, never, ever, ever hindi ka makaputan ng sobrang daming areas just for spending the credit cards. It's not that easy. Okay? So, again, sharing is caring. Share this video. And I do hope na if you have any questions, comments, just comment down below. Don't forget to hit this vid like this video, subscribe to my channel, and then share this video if you found it useful. Bye, guys! Thank you.